dear viewers today i am going to show you the basic plc trainer developed by national infotech so this is the uh, view of the basic plc panel so first of all uh, you can turn on uh, this panel so you can turn on this mcb okay so turn on the mcb and you can see uh, this plc is uh, switch is the or run mode okay so by using those uh, changing uh, then close the door and turn on the power supply okay so this plc will be turn on fully turn on okay now uh, we will description about the panel so here this is the 24 volt uh, output okay if you have using 24 volt as a digital input then you can use from here okay and also 24 volt uh, supply is here so you can use it okay so this section is the digital input uh, section uh, total eight digital inputs are there uh, if you uh, uh, here there is two possibilities in a external input or internal input if you have using the internal input then you can just toggle this switch to uh, downside then uh, internal uh, digital inputs are used okay if you have using the external inputs then you can connect the 24 volt to this okay panel so this is the external inputs are used here okay uh, likewise this uh, then this uh, uh, this section is the digital output section so this section uh, here there is a relay is connected here so this is the output of the relays okay so if you have using the any load from here then you can use uh, uh, if you have connect any load from here then you can use this 24 volt so you can see here there is a circuit so you can use this 24 volt supply here okay then uh, you can connect any load from here and uh, output of the load is connected to the y0 and uh, your black is connected to this black terminals okay so this uh, is work as a digital output pins with the relay connection okay so likewise this you can use uh, this circuit and uh, you can use this supply but if you have not uh, connected any load from here then you can just directly uh, uh, program any digital input pins and digital output pins and you can see here so if uh, 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 okay so this is the digital output pins this is the analog output okay if uh, you want any variable uh, voltage up to 0 to 10 volt as a, a analog input then you can use this uh, analog output so you can just connect uh, this to terminal as here okay uh, red to red black to black okay so likewise this you can use it uh, and these two pins are deck uh, deck output okay so deck 1 and deck 2 okay this for voltage this for current is the ground voltage current and ground for this two pins are deck pin okay and this section is the analog so analog to digital converter total four uh, adc pins are there so in the two adc we have used voltage and current uh, and uh, ground and uh, two adc only voltage are there okay so voltage and ground so this is the overall uh, uh, introduction and these two pins are the communication pins ok so communication port so here you can connect uh, uh, RS232 ok so this wire you can connect here so this wire you can connect here uh, uh, this is the uh, RS232 wire and uh, for the communication uh, you can use this uh, bafo uh, you can use this cable uh, rs485 okay so if you have dumped the any code in the plc then you can use this uh, cable uh, uh, to you can connect this cable here and uh, this cable is connected with the uh, uh, with the pc okay so this communication is done with the uh, laptop uh, to the PLC uh, okay and uh, if you have uh, code like a communication code is there then you can use RS485 here okay so RS485 port is here so you can connect RS485 here uh, and uh, uh, it is output is connected with the uh, PC okay so this is the overall description of the panel now we have uh, move on to the useful software okay so you can see here this software are useful for the uh, uh, basic plc trainer kit okay so first uh, for the plc programming uh, 
you can use this software and uh, you, you, uh, for the communication uh, programming for the communication programming you can use this uh, mode bus software either you can use this software or you can use this software okay both are same okay so you can use any one okay and uh, for the plc to the uh, pc connection rs232 cables are there if you, uh, you have no uh, you don't have a driver to connect a plc to the laptop okay so you can use this uh, 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 driver and uh, for the mode bus uh, software you can use this uh, driver okay so basically th those software are useful for the plc okay so here i have already uh, installed the all the softwares okay so you can see here this software is for the plc okay this software is for the communication okay so though these two software are useful for the plc programming so now oh, i i have show, show the first uh, uh, any first exercise so you can see here first exercise is the deck okay uh, so if you have double click this uh, file then this okay so uh, we have seen another okay so first uh, we have seen the digital io uh, so okay so in the digital io uh, okay so this is the software uh, now uh, now first uh, we have seen this software basic okay so from here uh, in this software you can see uh, if you have connected the uh, if you have connected this uh, R uh, RS-232 already connected with the laptop then uh, now you can check this RS-232 is here ok so it is uh, USB to serial COM port ok so you can uh, make sure it is uh, any COM port is there so it is COM port 3 so now you can uh, connect this COM port with the communication setting and you can set here okay so you can uh, select this com3 okay and as it is you can uh, set as it is okay then okay so you have uh, now connected with the plc uh, to laptop okay then uh, uh, this compiler okay so load once any uh, programs is there you can uh, load this okay so this is load build is done so you can see here compiling is completed now uh, for the loading uh, for the dump of this code into the plc you can uh, use this okay right to plc okay so just click on once you can click on it and uh, make sure this is pc to plc means uh, you can dump the program to pc to the plc okay so just click on the ok yes and uh, this program is dumped okay then click yes and uh, uh, now if you uh, if you want to see actual programming uh, means uh, on this uh, plc board okay on this plc board whatever uh, it is working or not uh, you have uh, clearly observed with the software so you can just click on this button so everything is uh, going with the online okay so first uh, we have see the uh, code okay so this basic code basically it is uh, uh, in uh, digital input okay here this is the digital input and here is the digital output so if i am pressing this uh, digital input button then uh, uh, your output will be shown here okay so now we can see this same code uh, on the plc okay so this is the x1 okay on in the on the plc board this is the x uh, sorry x0 is here then uh, on the plc is x0 is here x1 x1 x2 x2 x3 x3 x4 x4 okay and x5 x6 x7 x5 x6 and x7 so this is the digital input I, I am using the digital input as a internal inputs okay so when I am toggling this switch as an internal input then uh, your output will be like that 
okay as per the programming so digital input pins is directly connected with the digital output pins okay so when I am uh, toggling this switch to the internal uh, inputs so you can see here I am toggling this as a uh, turn on uh, means I am uh, input this something okay so you can see here it is inputs are there so it is green and outputs are there so you can see he inputs are there and outputs are there okay so uh, likewise this you can uh, see on the PLC as well as in the software okay so when I am toggling this x1 x2 x3 okay so x1 x2 x3 x4 x5 6 and 7 so all the LEDs are blinking here okay so likewise this you can you uh, see the outputs okay so this is the first exercise basic exercise of the uh, software uh, with uh, PLC okay so now if uh, you want to dump any other code then you can just uh, offline it okay and uh, you can close the uh, program and you can dump another thing okay so likewise this you can use it okay if uh, uh, you don't know which uh, program is uh, in the PLC then you can uh, click on the software any programs are there then you can just click on this button read from the PLC okay make sure your uh, cable is connected properly okay then you can just read from the PLC then these blocks are there so P PLC to PC okay this uh, uh, this section you can select it PLC to PC then click on the OK okay so it will take some milliseconds and uh, uh, it will open uh, which code are uh, dump in the PLC you can easily track this okay so this is useful buttons one two and if you simulate uh, a without PLC you can simulate this uh, program then you can use these two buttons okay so likewise this you can uh, uh, track your uh, program with the PLC uh, by using the communication port COM1 okay so uh, another thing we will explain in the next video